delicious. As always, my dear. I don't know how you do it. Whether it's the timing or the marinating, but... Mm. It's absolute heaven. No, I still can't believe it's already been six weeks. That son of a bitch only gave you three, at most. Huh. Just so frustrating, you know. They pretty much take our entire savings and smugly reply, oh well, you're screwed. See ya. Sweetheart, you're, you haven't touched your food. Here, let me help you. See? Service with a smile. It always amazes me how still you can be. Perfectly calm. Tell us something good. Do I ever sugarcoat things? Just let her speak, Joel. It's not good. The chemo that we had hoped would knock things out only stalled it by days. I've gone over the results. The cancer has metastasized to your other organs. It's inoperable. The only silver lining is um, you won't have to do chemo anymore. How long? Don't, don't say that. She's wrong. You're wrong. I mean, she's been doing just Joel, fine. Please, just let her speak. It's all. The results are here. This is the worst part of my job. I mean, this might as well be in Mandarin. I mean, what the hell are you trying to say? That it's, uh... I studied those tests vigorously. I tried so hard to find a discrepancy and I couldn't find it. It showed up like clockwork. There's gotta be something you can do, I mean, She doesn't deserve this. You gotta cut her a break. Science uh, doesn't bargain with us. You know, nobody deserves this shit. It's just a DNA roll of the dice. What you need to do is you need to take her home for the next three or so weeks and make it the best ever. Show her how strong you are and that you want to ensure this beautiful ending with joy. Make her comfortable and happy. That's all you can do. It's all I've ever wanted to do for her. I know. And you need to go back to Sims. She ah. said you missed the last two sessions. Come on, Jen. I got you as my punching bag. You know, I've never been into this whole kind of vent to a complete stranger kind of thing. I know, but it's, um, it's very therapeutic. You always have me, Joel. But sometimes it's nice to have a fresh pair of, of ears to hear our thoughts. Come on. Go see Sims. And show Vivian your love. 
I'm going to get you through this, Joel. decision I've ever made. Hanson didn't know what the hell she was talking about. And Sims. <laughs> Sims. All she ever wants to do is prescribe. As if she's trying to reach her weekly quota. I'm just glad everything's fine now. I love you, baby. What's for dessert? 